Puma has been there uh, in this country since a very long time and it's a very uh, known and a global brand. How do you keep up with, you know, uh, being relevant to the different kind of audiences? Well, thanks. Um, uh, pleasure uh, joining you um, on, on this chat. Uh, well, I think it's a very pertinent question because as a brand, uh, staying relevant with the audience is extremely important uh, because that's the only way in which the audience engages with you and consumers that way is keep coming back to the brand because, you know, if one has to run a profitable company, you need consumers who are engaged and keep coming back to you, right? I think that's the, uh, you know, as simple. So uh, various ways. Uh, I think there is no, not one answer to this, but I'll just try to pick various parts of this puzzle. First and foremost, first and foremost, if I, I'll start with the marketing funnel. So when a consumer is discovering the brand and you want to be, um, you want to be considered by the, by, by the consumer. So you need to appeal to the audience in a, in a, in a platform or a language that the consumer feels is relevant. Uh, today, you know, the, the times of just putting forth your product in front of the consumer and expecting the consumer to buy is gone because the, the, the consumers have evolved, right? So you need to have a story or a narrative about the brand, which is um, very, very, um, you know, relatable uh, to the consumer. So it starts with having the right kind of a, brand approach and, and campaigns flow from there uh, and contents actually then turn get churned out with this type of a thought process and that's what we have done in india so we have not come up with um, you know campaigns which are just cup, cut copy pasted uh, because we are a global brand and and connecting with the indian audience is always required to speak the language that the audience understands in india 